My name is DeGray, and I'm a church boy. So um, the title of my piece is Have You Heard My Story? It's just a piece, a whole story about, you know, my journey through life from grass to grace, how God has lifted me from where I was to where I am now. So I hope you all enjoy it and you are ministered to. Amen. How can I forgive God for all that happened to me? Have you heard my story? Then he tells a tall tale about how his mother and his father were at each other's throats and how like Wolverine they ripped the family apart from ear to ear. I said, here, open your ears and listen. A few years ago, this was my mindset. Have you heard my story? I couldn't even tie my shoelaces properly, but I had seen ties broken. My young tears when I saw him hit her. With no regard for that little boy who was standing there, that little boy who couldn't hold back his fear. I saw my mother's tears mix with blood and drop by drop they hit the floor like Abel's and you want me to sing my God is able? Have you heard my story? I remember that day they had another bout and God and I could care less what it was about. He picked his keys and stepped out into his car he stepped in and her anger deep within she picked the log and fired the windscreen she locked him out. Shattered glass everywhere. He battered her here and the neighbor screaming in my ear with no regard for that little boy who was standing there. That little boy who couldn't hold back his fear. And where was God? I, I know he wasn't there. Have you heard my story? Finally, she left us all alone and only then I could say I felt at home. My house was as quiet as a cemetery, dead to the joys of childhood. See, I was crying deep within, but outside I was titanium tough. <laughs> I created this facade of joy, this illusion that Houdini will be proud of. So, well, when I saw the alcohol and drugs on TV, I got attracted. If my mom and dad could do bad, then I had the right to do bad, so much bad to hit back at my mom and dad for all the tears and blood they made me see. To hit back and drop bombs on them like Baghdad in your face, mom and dad. So I puffed little clouds of smoke to cloud my dark heart. It would have been more, but I had no idea where to get the right drug. Have you heard my story? See, I was a slave of sin. I almost threw in the towel to accept defeat, but I kept finding new energy to stay on my feet. I knew it wouldn't have been God. He allowed the devil to torment me while he checked to my heartbeat. See, I was an eyesore. Yes, I saw. Was an eyesore until I saw a light that made my eyes sore. I met John 3.16 and realized what he had lost for me. Gave up his only son just to set me free. See, I was at the crossroad between the Broadway and the narrow road. I needed to pick up my cross and follow the cross road upon which my Savior with his cross strode. See, I was being infested with vanity. Well, I should have been investing in eternity. See, they were spat in his face for my sake. He was battered and bruised for my sake. He bled for my sake. And where was God? He was so heartless to let his only son die for no one but me. So how can I forgive him, you ask? Have you heard his story? See, he lifted me, his word changed me. He said I should take it slow and let my past pass me by. He will take me fast and let my future last. See, he made me a new bombshell and not a blast from the past. I experienced Genesis all over again when he said I was a new creation. Cause my past life was null and void, but he took it and molded it. He breathed into it once again when sin suffocated it. See, I was under Satan's asthmatic attack. <sighs> until Jesus became my inhaler. He said your past life might have hurt you but I will be your healer. He said see you don't have to worry about your past faults and flaws. You don't need to cling on to those passion stories. See that day when he hung upon that cross with a crown of thorns upon his head. He did it for me when he hung upon that cross and screamed out Father, Father, Father why had thou forsaken me? He was asking each and every one of us have you 